Hello and welcome to Creative Nerds. Today I've got a quick tip to share with you on how you can turn a rasterized image of a logo into a scalable vector. So take this image that we've downloaded from the internet, for instance, of the Twitter logo, which unfortunately is a image, which if we make it bigger, it becomes rasterized. You can see like it's pixel it's pixelated around the edges. It's just that it's just not that sharp crisp effect and if you wanted to print it on a magazine for instance it would come out distorted and the logo will be unreadable so today we're going to show you a quick tip on how you can turn this logo into a scalable vector so when it's resized it rem it keeps its high quality original format so if you undo this and we'll show you how to do it it's pretty simple so we're just going to select the image and then simply head over to image trace Select a little drop down menu and select silhouettes. Okay, and then what it's done is turned the logo into a vector. So, what we want to do is select the image again and select object, expand, um, ensure object and fill is selected, and then select the OK button. We're then going to select object, ungroup. I'm just going to delete, ensure only black back layer is selected and we're going to delete it do that again sorry back layer selected delete and then we're going to regroup it object group now if we drag it down from the anchor point you can see it's turned into a scalable vector and there's no distortion or pixelation around the edges. You can make this logo as big or as small as you want and it will still keep the same quality. You can make it the same size as a football pitch and it will not distort it or pixelated. Hope you've enjoyed this quick tip tutorial and I'm sure it will definitely be useful in your design projects. Thanks for watching and stay tuned to Creative Nerds.